Hi Po Teachers! Welcome to a new video featuring ClassPoint, an interactive teaching in PowerPoint. I'm Astro Johnny, one of the ClassPoint certified trainers in the Philippines, and I also have my YouTube channel, my Astro Johnny. The main objective of this video is to make PowerPoint one of the most commonly used teaching tools to become interactive with the help of ClassPoint. So for this video, we will be explaining one of the features of ClassPoint that is to transform multiple choice activity into an interactive multiple choice activity. So how will we do that? So again, we have here a particular slide and we want this to become interactive. So all we have to do again is to escape first and then we click Ink No Class Point once that is installed in your computer. All we have to do is to select multiple choice and then we have to set it up so let's move it here and then we can notice here that there are four choices we can select how many choices we have so we have here four choices and then we click has correct answer we will click this one and then we will select the correct answer which is letter B so once that we set it up we can also click the play options we can start question slide minimize result window after question starts or we can set up timer for our PowerPoint slide. That's how good it is. So we click this one and we choose 15 seconds, 30 seconds, 1 minute, 2 minutes. It's all up to us. For example, we set it up at 30 seconds and then that's it. Okay, let's see. So let's share it again. Let's click slideshow. So before we begin, let our students join by clicking the class code so that they can join in two possible ways. First, they go to classpoint.up. Just simply type in their Google search engine box, class point that up, and then they will encode the class code, which is what you see on the screen, or simply or simply scan the QR code that you see here on the screen, and then they will be typing their name. So once they're ready to type name, then they're good to go. Okay, so let's see. Let's start. Again, so we have the three participants joining, so we're good to go. So we can start now by clicking the multiple choice button. So this time students will uh, see the options. Now what's good with this one is that we can also add timer. So we set it up at 30 seconds but if you want to add timer, you just simply click on this one. So plus 15 seconds again, another 15 seconds, another 15 seconds. This is how amazing ClassPoint is. So sometimes connection problem or other more things to consider, you can have this one. A good feature from ClassPoint. Okay, so once we are done, we can click here, close submission. And then we can see now the correct answer. So A, B, C, D. What is the correct answer? Show correct answer. The correct answer is letter B. And when we click on this one, we can see that Uno and Dos got the correct answer. That's how good it is. So we can also again insert the result as slide. And then we can save it for review. So you can see now that the result of the um, multiple choice activity converted into a PowerPoint slide. That's how amazing ClassPoint is. So isn't it amazing? Stay tuned for new videos and webinars featuring ClassPoint. Thank you.